Hi, and welcome back to Budgeting by Dina US. I appreciate you coming by today and spending some time with me. Anyway, I've got some uh, happy mail, some really interesting stuff to show you. Um, let's start out with that, but I appreciate all my subscribers for coming back. And I've had a few new subscribers that have um, subscribed, but it got deleted by YouTube. Um, apparently, something's going on that... If you don't watch a video and hit like, whatever, it sees you as a robot and deletes you. You can't just subscribe and go about your day. So, make sure to watch a video or two. Anyway, this is for Misfits of Budging. I just love their Highland Cow stuff. And as you can see, all the sunflowers with the cow, this is a 60 plus. That plus always worries me. And I got some neat little stickers here. A little purple cow with a flower. And it says, Dina, thank you for supporting my small Leslie shop. I'm happy saving Mary. And then I got this beautiful little uh, Highland cow here. And it's got heart stickers on it. And I just want to figure out where in the world you get them or make them. That'd be so neat. Anyway, we got that. And then this one here is from Laura Bell Creations. And like I said, she has started an Etsy shop. And um, please go over and check her out and give her some support and see it and like some stuff. And if you're interested in buying, please do that. But anyway, let's see. I think that's all. Okay. I've got some real cute stickers here. Love my stickers. Little Care Bears. I thought that was cute. And this one here is just beautiful. It's a honeybee. It says happy on it. And then it says, Dina, thank you for all your support. You are truly an amazing, uh, truly amazing, my friend, Laura. And a cute little card here that she sent. And these are some of her cards she made. This is the one I ordered. This is, uh, says, love me. It's a Valentine one with save $60. And then she sent me this one as a free gift. But these are the cutest little Highland cows. If you can see that. And this is a roll and save. And then we got from uh, LV Budgets, I ordered this, and again, I did the wrong thing and didn't bother um, checking to see the denominations before I ordered. I am going to play them, but I'm going to be afraid to do so. Let me get these out and let you see them. Okay, we got a little owl there. And it says, I love rainbow, and a, I forget what these are called. These, uh, not mosaic. Mandela, I think it's, I, I'm not sure. Anyway, this says, thank you, and it says, appreciate your support, Laura. And in here, I got four cards with tiny little stickers. And good thing there's a ton of them, because each one of these has saved 250. And I've never played um, any cards for that amount, so, this is, four cards, that's a thousand dollars, we're gonna play them, it might take me a while to get through them, but we're gonna do that, and then this one here is from Laura Bell Creations, and it says, darling, you are a work of art, and I love these stickers she has, and she always does a great job with, um, packaging her items, I mean, I don't use tissue paper, but she does. But this is a new item that she's come out and designed. And it is just absolutely beautiful. Oh, look. It says, hi, Dina. Thank you for giving me a nudge to finish the investigation project. Love and blessings to your entire family. Your friend, Marion. It says, P.S. Tell my boyfriend I said hello. <laughs> that's my dad. My dad teases with her. But that's uh, a cute little savings there. And this... Uh, let me see. This item here is her uh, new. She came up with an investigation book, a Who Done It, and this comes with the book. Let's see what all we have here. And with this, what you get? Oops, lost something there. Is a sticker that you could put on your envelope, which is really neat. It matches. It matches the book. But you get a dice, and this is colored. Each, each number is different colors. You get a little person playing kit, or uh, 
and then you get a, what is this, a nine-sided, a nine-sided dice, and, and then you get a color one, which I don't want one of them. So anyway, she left my sticky note on there with my name, but this here is the busted detection detective. Anyway, here you go. It tells you about the investigator and uh, the different colors. And it's talking about the outline of the book, I believe, is uh, who, where, what, when, why, and how. So the investigation notes here is where you put your, um, put your results of your investigation. But as you can see in here, and I believe she, I'll have to check, but I believe she said you could cut this to make it an envelope if you wanted to. But this here is the who page and the suspect, and it's a tic-tac-toe. And what you're going to do is you're going to play here, find out the hair color, the male or female, and the suspect. Then you're going to turn the page and come over to where, and this is the location. And you, you could see all these different locations here. And then the different color flags, and you roll the color dice to um, figure out which one you give. And whichever, I believe, I haven't read these directions, but I believe whichever gets the most amount of money is the location to where the crime event uh, happened. This is the what, and this is a little game that goes down here. And this tells you what happened, what offense happened. And I'll tell you, you would love these. I had to talk her into putting stickers on them so she wouldn't give away the answers. And then date of incident, so you got that, and when, and these are different t um, times of the year, like Halloween and Valentine's and st stuff, and you scratch this off, and you tally it up and see when it happened. And then you got the motive, the why. And this is playing Tri-Peak Solitaire is what this is, and again, Here's where you scratch off to find out why they murdered. And then you come back here, and this is how they did it. And this here is where you fill in um, if it was done by wine, pan, or pencil. And you got to do hit and miss. And you mark down here for every hit, $2, every miss, a dollar, whatever you want to put in there. But that is just an awesome awesome and this is a big heavy book with metal binding and also I thought this was cute right here um this is a little magnifying glass you get and you can see it actually works but the neat part about it is you could pop it out and use it for a scratch off and then just put it back when you're done so it's it's got multi-uses but the other thing is is don't quote me on the date but if you do this book and you do all the who, what, where, and why, and how. Um, she's having a contest, a drawing. And I think it's in July sometime to win a $50 gift card to Etsy. So, anyway, this is what you're going to be getting from that. And please go over to Laura Bell Budget and Design. I'll put her um, link in the description box. And uh, please go over there and see about purchasing this. I, it's a really good thing. It's something that you'll definitely get your money's worth out of that. Let me go ahead and clean this up and we get started today. And today we're going to play our, our um, game of uh, rock, paper, scissors. I got a competition going, a friendly competition with uh, budgeting with on. And the winner of this wins a $25 Etsy gift card. And P.S. Don't tell her, but I'm in the lead so far. But I'm not going to brag because it'll probably fall. And so we'll be going about another two weeks on this. And this was made by Pact Accordingly. We both have the same game. And with the larger game here, you get four dice. And I'm going to use three of them. And... You can see here the fist, $3, hand, $5, scissors, a dollar. And if you roll three of a kind like I did right here, it's an automatic 10 points. So let's go ahead and call for that. Let's see. Hand, rock, paper, scissors. Good. Oop, let me get my, let's see. Rock, paper, scissors. So that'd be a three, five, and a one. So that'd equal nine for the first roll. Come on, babies. Give me a three of a kind. 
hand hand oh i almost did it oh that's just no fair so we got a five and a one here and a zero for that because i didn't get a fist so that's a total of six all right come on one more try today Let's see. Oh, I didn't do it again. I got rock, paper, scissors. So that's a total of nine again. Okay, so that's going to be three, five, and one, which equals nine. So we got nine plus nine is 18, plus six is 24. So I forgot to get my envelope out. This game here came with its own envelope. Maybe if I can find it. Here it is. The rock, paper, scissors. So we're going to go ahead and put the $24 in here and see what we're totaling. All right. So we got 20 and 1, 2, 3, and 4. Now, I hope you guys are rooting me on to win this so I could order some more stuff. I already know what I'm going to get if I win this. Okay, so we got 20, 40, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, and 73, which is wonderful. That is a great, great. I think she's up to 65 now, so she may pass me up. Well, I don't know. Give it your best shot on. We'll see who wins. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and put these dice over here get this out of the way and today we're going to be working on my notebook everything is always in the way when i do my notebook let's see can you see that yeah okay that's good all right so here we're going to start with this um because I, this is here is from Save with Judy, and this is saving $25 a month. And because I am not going to be playing this again from the end of the month, I'm going to go ahead and do two. So that will give me $25 for this month. So I'm coloring in two. Does anybody have plans for this weekend? I'm going to be babysitting grandbabies. So... Okay, and there's my 25, and I'm going to cash these in, or trade them in, cash them, yeah, for a 5, and I just plug my, I keep forgetting to get the envelope out for this, I need to do that, and I'm sorry, I forgot to tell you, I started with $215, is what I started with today. This is from Mystic Budgets, and this is the cow again. And we're going to color in one arrow for $5. I thought it was so funny. Um, they were doing a fundraiser at my granddaughter's school. And she wanted to do it. Now, she's only four years old. And what it was is animals. They're bringing in animals to um, take pictures with. And what? just take a guess what she decided to do for a... There's 20 there. I'm going to cash that in for a 20. She wanted to get her picture taken with a ball python. I was like, oh my God, a four-year-old girl wants to get a picture with a snake. More power to her. This is from Gentle Charm Budgets. And let me get... Okay. And uh, I'm not going to take a chance with this. I am going to roll a 12-sided dice because this one here hits me all the time. We've got a nine. One, two, three... Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we're down here. And let's see what we got. A five. Okay, good roll. Let's go ahead and roll it again then. Watch me get a big one because I always say let's do it again. That's number three right here. And a ten. That's not too bad. I can handle that. All right. And this is a $200 savings. But I haven't talked to my granddaughter yet, so I don't know if she chickened out or what, but I paid for it. So I said, I want the picture. Mommy can't have it. Let's see. We did 5 and 10, so that's 15. So let's take a 10 and a 5. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Let's see. We got 
20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, and 90. So just barely getting to halfway. So not bad. And this this here was a gift from Budgeting Budget and Craft by Aunt. She got that. And this one here is a gumball scratch off by Marion with uh M Lock Budget and Design. And I'm gonna go ahead and scratch a couple here and see what we get. This is a pink one, so it's probably a a three, yes. So we got a three. And let's go ahead and scratch one next to it. That's another three, so that's six. Let's see, let's do this one here. And a five, so that's $11. And we'll stop there today. But this is also a $200 savings, I believe. Yeah, 200. All right, let me clean that off. But this came with a beautiful envelope, and that's what I had to do when I got it. I just cut across here and opened it up into an envelope. So it was really interesting. All right, so we got 10 and 11. So let's see what we got. 10, 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, and 42. So we're moving right along in this one. Put the paper clip on it and put it back in here for now. All right. And now we're to rock and roll with Lisa, grateful me. And I need to roll some fives and sixes. I am just not getting those colors. Let's see. Oh, wrong dice. Hold on a second, guys. Let me get my giant dice so you can see what I get. Two ones. Uh, let's see, what color? Let's do a yellow. So we got one there and one there. Let's roll again. A three and a one. Three and a one. Let's roll one more time. Come on, five, six. We need some big numbers. There we go. We got a six. And we got a three. So we're done with our threes and we're done with our twos. So if I get two or three, I got to re-roll. So let's see. We got six, seven, eight, nine. And then six is 15. So we rolled a 15 there, and I hope you guys could see all that. Yeah, you're good. Let's move the dice out of the way and put 15 in here, and we'll go ahead and count this. This deck is getting a little thick here. So we'll see what it we'll see what we got here. At least I got a six. You can see how far behind I am in those fives. I can't roll a five to save my life. At 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, and 89. So 189 dollars so far. This thing will really start going crazy if I get those four, fives, and sixes. When we get to the end, I'm just going to have to start marking them and doing them. Okay, let's see what's next. Next one's by the Bliss Daisy Buzzy Budgets. And we're going to start at the top again. And, yeah, i got a few more I can roll. Let's see. Let's just roll one. Let's see. We've got a four. So we're right. One two, three, four. So that's six dollars. Let me go ahead and mark that out. So five and six. Let's roll again. A six. So we're coming at one, two, three, four, five, and six. So there's a five. And we're going to go ahead and stop there. So that was eleven dollars going in here. I don't know if this is help guide Santa home. So let's go ahead and put this in here. Oop, putting it upside down. All right, let's see. We got 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, ew, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, and 45. 
So we're doing good there. I don't know what happened to that dollar bill, but I, I'd be afraid to ask. Doesn't look too pretty. All right, now we're to the big scratch-offs by Heather Budgets. And this is for my Christmas savings. And let's just scratch one right here. It looks like a present, and the present is $20. Yeah, it's $20. So we're doing this the low budget way, so we're gonna add two for that. Let's go ahead and scratch another one. Same thing, got another gift for $2. All right, so let's put another two in. Let's try one more. I took my insulin pump off and set it in the other room so it wouldn't beep. Because I know it was beeping a lot today. And I could hear it. So excuse the noise in the background. All right, we got a reindeer. And a reindeer is 25 so that'll be $7. So let's see. Take that two and another three and get a five, so that's $11. Let me clean this off real good and we'll go to the next game. All right. Let's see what I got in here so far. <clears throat> Playing the low budget way. Low budget way is 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, and 32. Ooh. That's good. Okay, let's see what else we got from Heather Budgets. This one here is the birthday scratch off for me. This is going to go to my birthday. And if it. The, <laughs> Good bad thing is, is my grandson, my granddaughters, and my birthday are all days apart. So last year, they moved back home, and I threw them a big party and got a bouncy house and all kinds of stuff. We had about 30 people here for their birthday because they didn't know anybody here because they're so young, and they were born in Tennessee. Let's see, that's 10, so let me get 10. And um, we had a big birthday party for the three of us last year. So that's probably, if I get enough here, that's what I'm going to do again. Just throw a birthday party for the three of us. Of course, nobody got me a birthday present. They got them all. Uh, broke my heart. Not really. <laughs> 10, 20, third, er, 25, 30, 35, 36, and 37. So, but we had a wonderful time. And it's just so great to have my grandkids back home. Let's see here. Back to school scratch off. This is for my daughter. Let's see what we got in this one. Like I said, I, I'm using this to, um, just to pay for incidentals or anything that she might need uh, for schooling. Let's see. I'm not sure what this, it, oh, I think it's a blue eraser, I think is what it's supposed to be. And that is $10, so we'll stop there with 10. Let's see what we got. Clean that off real quick. All right, we're going to take these two 10s in for a 20, because I'm almost out of 10s. So we got 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, and 37. So we're doing good on that one too. And got a couple more. We got my Halloween scratch off. Let me see. Okay. Let's see what's under this one. This one looks like a pumpkin, I think. Kind of hard to scratch off. Yeah, we got a pumpkin here, and a pumpkin is $25. Wow. But I'm going low budget, so that gives me seven for that. And let's go ahead and do one more. I haven't got this one yet. It's a trick or treat sign, and that's 30. Oh my goodness. 
Oh, I'm not too worried. We're going low budget. So that'd be three dollars. Now don't forget on Sundays, each Sunday, uh, let's see, three dollars. I'm gonna put these two back and it's five back and get a ten. Um I do my giveaway each Sunday on my randomizer Sunday. So make sure you check that out for a chance to win. Uh, we get 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. So these are all doing about the same money-wise, so that's good. And then we got one more, which is my vacation scratch-off, saving up for my cruise. And we're going to go ahead and do this. I'm going to do this one because I got scratched somehow. And this looks like, oh, come on off of there. This looks like a camera. Yeah, that's what it is. And a camera is $20, so that's two. I wish I could afford to save 20 for my vacation. So let's put two in. Let's go over here and try this one. This is luggage. And luggage is 25, so that'll be seven dollars by adding the two and the five together. And clean it up. There it goes. So let's get seven and the five. So five, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's go ahead and add this up and see what we got total. So, for, for a vacation, we got 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, and 35. I am so looking forward. I go in next week to apply for my passport. I got everything together for that. And that's the last one in this book. get this out of the way. Boy, that thing's getting fat with that money in there. And I want to do my vacation book, but we go ahead and apply for our passports next week. So I want to get that. We got the Wandering Gnome and Under the Sea, and these are, um, these are our travel from All Things Kimberly, West Virginia. And we're going to go ahead and scratch it. I know in here, or I'm sorry, in this one, we made a mistake. You guys brought to my attention about this tin. So I went ahead and got that straight and got it all worked out. But this one here, I'm on the second page with the little sea turtles. So let me see. We'll go ahead and scratch one and see how we do. Miss Kimberly likes to shock me on occasion. So we'll see how we do here. A five. Thank you, Miss Kimberly. Kind of clean this off real good because I could use this again. I love it. Okay, so we got a five. And let's try this one. Oh no, Kimberly. Come on, girl. Get this woman a break. A 25. Oh my gosh. Kimberly, I'm not leaving you on my wheel. Matter of fact, you might make me cause, cause me to write bankruptcy. So we got 20 and 30. Okay, and so far in here, let's see. We've got 20 and a 30. So in this vacation binder so far, I've got put together, and I think I'm going to use this for the cash I'm going to take along. We've got 20, 40, 60, 70, 80. 90, 100, 100, 10, 115. Wow. Doing good there. And our cruise is in November. We're going for Thanksgiving. Never had, a, never been on a cruise, but I've never had Thanksgiving on a cruise either. So that should be mighty interesting. And this here is the Wandering Gnome, which is the one for my husband. And this one seems to have a little bit lower amounts here. So we'll see, but. Can't, can't take too much for granted when it comes to Kimberly, because she'll shock the pee out of you. 
and this is a half. I'm not exactly sure what I'm supposed to do with a half. Pay half of the next number? Pay one and a half the next number? But I'm going to pay one and a half because I want to try to get his up a little bit more. Because this is a little bit lower amount. So we got 11. So I would say half of 11 would be 5.5, but let's go ahead with a 6. So 11 plus 6 is 17. Let's do one more. 17 plus 4 is 21. Yep, yeah, it's a 4. So that would be 21. So let me go ahead and clean this up. Ugh. That one did clean off. There we go. I love that little vacuum. I just wish it was a little quieter. So we got 11 plus 6 is 17 plus 4 is 21. So let's go ahead and see what we got in here. So we got 10, 20, and 21. Okay. Let's see what we got in here all together. Never zip these things, but it takes so much time to get in and out of these that I don't ever zip them. Okay, so we got ones, fives, and tens. So let's see what he's got in his. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 96, 97. So he's a little bit behind me, but we'll get him caught up. All right. Now I've got a little bit more money over here. Let's see what I what I have left. We've got $20, $23. So I want to put that in my puppy binder because I had to go out and get a bunch of dog food and chicken feed for my chickens. And it cost me $111 and I'm not taking anything out of here. So let's see about putting the rest of this in there. I'm, I owe you in this one. No, I don't see an IOU. Guess not. So let's see how far 23 could take me. This one scratches off good. Ooh, 15. Now what I tell you about Miss Kimberly? I think me and Miss Kimberly's gonna have to go have a cup of coffee and have a long talk about her numbers. I guess I'm just not used to getting them because it, it, all the stuff that I produce in my um, shop is more for the medium to lower budgeter. And so that's 20. I'm going to stop there. All right. Um, so when I see these higher numbers, you know, I do higher numbers when somebody, you know, wants something special. I don't have a problem doing that. But, um... So, there's 20, but I'm, I'm used to, I like about medium numbers. I don't like high and I don't like little low ones. So, I'm, I'm an in-between girl. So, we got 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, and 90. So, we're still not there. But, I'm going to go ahead probably next week when I stuff it again, then go ahead and take what's in here to pay myself back. And this $3, I'm just going to, I can't play that anywhere, so I'm just going to save that until, um, until Sunday for the, um, the randomizer giveaway. And I appreciate you coming by today, and again, thank you to all my subscribers the new ones and the ones that have been here from the start. I appreciate it. And if you'll go over to my Etsy shop, I put out some new items today. And I forgot. Ooh. Hold on a second and I'll show it to you. I think it's really neat. But find it. Here it is. All right. Here we go. 
um, I have six different canisters, so they come in canisters, and as you can see, you know, they're neat, so it's just kind of random what canister you get, and it comes with a scratch-off with the keychain on it, and then what we have here is 20 different cards. They all are laminated, but as you can see, they're double scratch-offs, and they're different butterflies, beautiful designs, and I just loaded this into my Etsy shop um, last night, so if you'd like one of these, it is a limited supply, go ahead and, and get that, if not, if you wouldn't mind just going over and favoriting it, so that way it'll get pushed up where people can see it better, and, um, this is my new one, and I'll be coming out with another new one tomorrow, I don't have time to finish it today, but it's gonna be really cute, you'll love it, anyway, Thanks again, guys. I appreciate you coming. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.